Hello, my name is Alex with Systems Refine, and today I'm going to answer the question, how do you delete a user that is in many projects without going into each individual project to delete them? If someone has recently left your Asana organization or workspace, and you have a lot of projects that they were a part of, deleting them from all those projects could be a pain if you have to go through each individual project. Well, instead of doing that, I'll show you how to remove them from all tasks and then delete them very quickly. But before I show you, take a second, click on that like button, and click on subscribe to see more of my Asana Tips videos. All right, let's get to it. So the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is remove them from all tasks that they are assigned to. So in order to do that, you just click on the search bar, type in their name, and then highlight all the tasks, and then click on that X mark to remove all the tasks. And I will show you how to do that now. So I am going to search for Captain America. Here's all his tasks. Let me go ahead and highlight all of them. Just click shift and um, click on the first one and click shift and click on the last one and it'll highlight, highlight all of them. And the X mark is right here. And now he has no more tasks assigned to him. So the next thing I'm gonna show you is how to delete a user from a project. And to do that, just go to the project Click on the project followers. There's a drop down menu that you can click on uh, next to their name and then just click on remove from project. And here are, are a list of projects that Captain America is a part of and I'm just going to click on one of them. I'm going to do Casey and that's actually my dog. And you can see there he is right there. So you just click on the, um, the avatars, click on this drop down menu, remove from project and there you go. Next I'm going to show you how to remove a user from a team and it's pretty pretty simple. Just go to the team uh, that the user is part of, click on the invite people button, hover over the user's name, click on remove, and then click on remove access. Now, I just wanna make a note here that the user will not be removed from tasks if you just remove him from a team. Um, so just keep that in mind, and I'll show you uh, what I'm talking about. So if I go to testing grounds, I'm gonna remove him from here, so I'll just click on this invite people button, and then right here, click on remove, and then remove access. Now don't click on this yet, um, this is just if you want to remove him from a team. But as you can see, he still has tasks assigned to him here. And also in this one. So I'm currently in an organization, uh, but I want to show you how to delete a user from a workspace. So to do that, I just created a workspace um, called testing grounds and we're just gonna go there real quick and I'll show you how to delete a user from a workspace. So deleting a user from a workspace, the process here is just uh, click on that invite button, hover over, the per hover over the person's name, click on remove and then remove access. Okay, and you can see that he is part of a couple projects here and then he has a couple tasks in these projects. As you can see in test project one, there he is as a, as a follower and he has a task assigned to him. So let's go ahead and delete him. As you can see, he is not a follower of this project and he doesn't have any tasks as well. The last thing I'm going to show you is how to delete a user from an organization. And to do that, it's basically doing the exact same thing as removing a user from a team. So you just do the exact same steps, but there's one last step that you need to do, which is click on deprovision. Everything that Captain America was assigned to, he is now gone. Um, I did have a list of everything that he was uh, assigned or a uh, follower of. You see in templates, processes, and checklists, he was a team member, but now he is not. Um, some of the projects, uh, Casey, he is gone. Um, Asana course, he is no longer in it. And then even some of the tasks, uh, he had a task under website, Facebook campaign, list view, and board view. So and you can see he doesn't have any tasks assigned to him anymore. If you have any questions about deleting previous members, Leave a comment below and I'll get back to you as quickly as I can. Don't forget to hit that like button and click on subscribe to see more of my Asana Tips videos.
I hope you found this video valuable and I hope you have a productive day.